Bah. Bah. So, uh, Chisisek is all... Oh, I guess I shouldn't touch him. Great. I got as far as found Chisisek's body. I hope everybody else remembers that. <laughs> I can give you guys pointers on the questions. That's why I was going to do it off stream. Yeah. I can send you the ones you answer. Ask. Thank you. That would be great. Great. Because I need to chief them. I'm sure we missed some key ones. No. This is like turning into quite the, quite the book. You actually got them all in order. Oh, good. Never mind then. Sorry, you missed one. No, yeah, you got them all. So we were I'm just going to send them to you on Facebook. Okay, thank you. Um, yeah, I, I do it by day. I also I have this section where we killed... The Forgotten Pharaoh. Are you back yet? Nope. I'm hanging out by Lady's body. By the Forgotten Pharaoh's body? Yep. Yeah. Just um, like hanging just out like by this. Bodies? What a... I'm just considering just how shitty it is. This is how it ends for her. She made her bed. That's fair. I'm just what? gonna like sit in the corner and stare at Rodrigo. There's nothing else in this at the room. Body. Hey, that's just, just a sex. Yeah. So just... I'll go I should ask this before we start the recording. Yeah. What if I had broken that effigy earlier to ask a Goethe Blue question? Um, the. <laughs> <laughs> we would have killed you. No, um, the Teddy Sura, the guardian of Chesisek's tomb, said mm. if you brought him back, she could let you ask questions through her. Oh. Yeah. Okay, good. Just towing a corpse through the desert. <laughs> hey, you guys, you guys promised you'd bring her back. We did. You'd bring back Chesisek? Yeah. And the bee larva. The bee larva we still got to do. Yeah. Oh, so we actually have to bring back just a tag. Yes. yes. You guys said you would. How are we going to carry him? Fucking bolt. bag of holding. Plus, plus <laughs> six. Does it I fit? Mean, <laughs> I mean, yeah. it does. I mean, he's a <laughs> real old. He's, he's dead. I was just going to say, he just got a plus six belt of strength. He could just so one-handed fucking. Food rots and people die, but what happens to dead bodies? He is, he's, he's mummy, he's, he's mummified. Right. Mummy. So we can, we can totally stick him in the bag hole. <laughs> yeah. Wrap him back up in his bandages first. Yeah, no, let, like let, his bandages have like withered away. No, I'm just, gonna rewrap, can I find any new band or new herb bandages? I was just gonna put the lid on and... Uh, the, the tomb? <laughs> of the, of the tomb? Do, uh, yes. with your knowledge just of burials, tip, tip uh, it's probably down. best yeah, to I'm do this at an actual burial site as opposed to out here. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna say. So yeah, so no, I mean like wrapping him up in bandages. So, like, if you do that when you get to his site. Where's so you, his site? Um, just his next tomb. Where we have to was, take him back to. Where we have to take him back to. You which are told by Chief. Yeah. No, 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 no. You know. like, I, I just want to, like, somehow wrap him up so when he puts him in the bag, it just doesn't all fall apart as... as so I just need it bandages won't. or some clothes. It won't. Off. It's fine. It's done. He's an object. He's a single item that appears in your inventory. Just a second. Yeah, there, I, 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 if this was D and D five, I'd give you an inspiration point for that. So I appreciate it, but his body's <laughs> fine. Like that is a very good statement. Sounds good. Yeah. Perhaps someone... you check over the body to make sure that he won't decay on the trip. Sounds yeah. Good. Yeah. I'll do that. New party member hype gonna weekend in burn. Twenty two. Yeah. You know that he he he's been preserved so old and so well that especially in the bag of holding where he's not gonna be jostled around a lot. Second question. Go for it. What's a flaming arrow worth? Okay, one single it. flaming arrow? Yeah. Nothing. Okay, 32. You want to sell me one arrow? One 32. single? 32. Um, you have to sell them in groups of 50 to get any sort of value out of okay, them. Okay, sounds good. I just can't find it anywhere online of what actually value is. So there's in, in nothing. In theory, I could break it down. So yeah, you know what, Mike? You get a hero point. You could always award oh, yeah, hero a, points. There's a section for that, isn't there? Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, not they're powerful. The standard one, yeah, you but... get one hero point for that. That was good role playing. Beyond just, you know, believing your character is angry, it's good. Which is also good role playing. Don't get me wrong. But I always like it when people, you know, use the influence of their backstory and character knowledge. Pardon? What can I use oh that? man, look it up. There's so many things you can do. <laughs> yeah, they're strong. You can like deny death. With okay, it. so out of out of. We're going back to camp. Side thought. When we counted pages, or all, all the party treasure the first time, I counted platinum pieces as gold pieces. So now I've actually converted all the platinum over Jeez. to actual gold. It's a lot more than... Actual gold. Actual gold. Actual Good gold. to know. Actual gold. So, we'll... I'll still... We'll do this off stage. Okay. Mm -hmm. Cool. General note. Okay. I'll try... So. Priced out somewhere for actual items as well. That is. Honestly. 
Um, are you guys going back? You guys are going back to the cult, the, or, yeah, the, the paladin room. Yeah. She's like, I'm still upset with you, but you did a noble thing. I, I, You're welcome. I'm gonna take a bed roll and just kind of. <laughs> she starts walking around the room again. This room is boring. Is that what she said? Yes. So, yeah, when we kill those three things, things, you can just dissipate. I can go. We'll do that. Where do you go? Away. Here, where do we, the afterlife? Hmm. I joined Saranre, where she has deemed me to go. When do you go there? When we when kill we, the three when things. When we finish. Yes, I'm trapped here. That was very rude. I'm sorry, she's checking. <laughs> Look at a very <laughs> blunt witch. I'm sorry, I apologize. <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm just getting into my character. Look, she's <laughs> reacting to you. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. She's from Ustalov. It's. I so, am I social? Ustalov. Well, she's not evil. No, no, no. I'm fine. I What's just my crit? social <laughs> cues are poor. Uh, years I'm ago, uh, the paladins awkward. of uh, Saranra and Iomade uh, uh, launched a crusade in Ustalov. I don't even know what I did. You didn't do it. Well, you. You're fine. You, it's. Fine. I need a hug. Uh, okay. <laughs> she hugs, she hugs all of Hanya. <laughs> Hanya charges up because of oh, I was really hoping someone else would jump on that. But nobody wanted to <laughs> yeah, show no. me any love. It'll be like That's one fine. of those weird, like, behind hugs. I'm like, they're there. I'm like one of those I'm... guys at a funeral home. I don't really like alive people. <laughs> So you sidle up to this the ghost. Is good. I'm glad we did. I am. I, I really like the ghost, especially since she's also a paladin. I mean, right. I did cure you like a f million times. Uh, speaking of. Oh, but now you want something. <laughs> we're gonna rest. And we're not gonna heal you. What, what's, I don't fine. Know what's happening? Rodrigo I... has no idea what's going on. We need to make a game plan. He was gonna uh, ask for healing, and I said we're not gonna heal you because we're gonna rest. I was gonna ask. For a curse removal. Oh, right! Oh, you want yeah. my curse she removal. She can't do that until she rests. She has to, I need to prepare rest different That's spells. Fine. <laughs> Thank you. You'll need to roll one more. And then uh, my services here will be used. Used? No, it's... <laughs> Did you want to go cut the Forgotten Pharaoh up? <laughs> no, 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 no! I would love to help you. Thank you. I'm just being sassy. Sassy. Also, again, no social cues. Um, she also had a <laughs> I'm picturing sure, sure she's saying this all out loud. I don't know what the fuck you guys want. A game plan. Keep going. What are you looking at me? I'm looking at the compressor behind you. Keep going. <laughs> we need to make a game plan. Correct. We need to kill three things. Yes. We need to... Sargoda. Yes, I have a rest command that. and Ninu reset. Is yes. it the ghost talking again? Yes. Yes! Can you. I just wasn't sure because it sounded like Justin this time, so I didn't know. Who's Justin? Justin? Oh, for the love of God! I was just confused for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Roasted! Okay, so we need to kill three things, return the bee, and return Chisisex body. And stop the end of the goddamn world. Yeah, we'll do it. No big deal. We gotta do everything in this fucking place. But... Salty language for paladin. I'm not paladin. Isn't this your homeland? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna look at Olive. Who then just smiles at me like this and Roderick is like, I'm alone again. <laughs> no, no. Should we... <laughs> Do anything with the Forgotten Pharaoh's body. Yeah, leave it in... Oh, Forgotten Pharaoh. Should we leave it there to rot, or should we do something about it? Well, it wasn't the Forgotten... Well, well, I guess he... It he, was the Forgotten Pharaoh, it wasn't Hakotep. But well, I think once Hakotep left the body, I don't think it was the Forgotten Pharaoh. Anymore. Yes, it is. The body itself is the Forgotten Pharaoh. She has no name. She is the Forgotten Pharaoh. Hakotep is in her body. We'll burn it just to be safe. Yeah, do you want to say a few words? Well, yeah, you mean right. like destroy it and then like should we give it burial rights? <laughs> no, Burning would be safer if uh, the, the actual person if Hakatek's can... touch can do this to you. I don't know what it can do with a corpse that it leaves behind. Do what? 
the about droopiness. It. You're fine, buddy. The rot. You're looking good. You're looking uh, a, a bit pale. You're real strong, though, man. <coughs> oh, shit. I was just looking at your face. And then... Just for reference, in the morning when you wake up, yeah. your charisma's down to one. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> He's gonna wake up like melted. All right. So what I'm gonna need you to do oh, is before you go to bed, God. you Don't need see to the witch. Ask, you need to ask Olive very, very, very nicely to fix you in the morning, because you may not be able to ask very, very nicely. Yeah, Olive already agreed to help. Did you ask her nicely, though? Yes, I did. I don't know that you did. did. I did. I'll go burn the body. Uh, if you uh, hear I me, will come with you. if you hear us running and screaming, it's because that creature found Sorry, us in the hallway. Uh, no, the woman uh, that we freed. The witch. Oh. That's the witch. No, no, no. But the other, not that the high witch. priestess. The high <laughs> yes. priestess. That's her. the one. The one that was in the wall. She stands up and says, "What?" The high priestess? Yeah. She's still wandering free. We, we, we think the Sphinx killed her now, but... No. 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 She's the high you priestess think that. of we don't think that. This is a, This is not good. <coughs> it means they are probably working together now. Oh, good. Yep. All three of them? All two of them. Potentially. Three? The, yeah, well, there's three we have to kill, yeah. and now the high priestess, so actually it's four. Yeah. Good. I mean... Yep. Great. They'll all die. It's fine. The paladin just sits down <laughs> and just stares forward. I'm gonna be here forever. <laughs> I'm never gonna leave. Just out of curiosity, what happens if they, they can't wander into this room? Can they? I mean, they can. Don't she looks down the hallway and just stares at the mud room, which is right next to this room, and she just stands up and she says, Oh God, I, if the high priestess is here, I don't think if I can keep my wards much longer. Um, okay. Okay, yeah, cool. <sighs> let's go, Brendan's body. No, let's stay. Okay. We'll burn it tomorrow. We'll, we'll have time. Alright, you guys all... Do we, do we find the need to uh, keep watch in this room? She okay. said she will. Yeah, she's going to. She doesn't say <laughs> She's kind of just, but still kind of just catatonic, just... Sweet. So, what was that shit about a slave? And he smelled you, and why does he want you? First While slave, they're doing this, Rodrigo know. is clearing away some of the corpse, the paladin stuff to start making a bonfire. Cool. Last tomato. Know. Why would I know? I don't know. I what? have I have no history with this man. You you were the one with reading all the books. Well, that was optional. You would you would know far better than I would why this fucker needs a slave. Well, I just was wondering what uh I don't know. I don't know why anybody needs a slave. Cheap labor, I guess. Uh. I start to help you. <laughs> I tell you where the bacon is. We're just gonna cook away from this conversation. That's, that's oh, over. I'm, help you. I'm counting oh, gold. No. I'm counting gold stuff. Uh, As I'm coming with <laughs> Yeah, you two are now alone talking. Well. Thanks. Yeah, it is. My laughter is because your Christmas was low, and I'm sorry, but it's just funny. So you just burst out laughing like in game when you said. I it? also, yeah. I, I pushed some bacon into your mouth <laughs> to stop you from making any more sounds. We're going. We're going to that place, aren't we? That those slave trenches. Great. I mean, cool. Where else would you have us bring down a temple? No, I. We gotta go there. It'll be great. I'll be fine. No problem. I'm not gonna be grumpy about it at all. Sounds like the opposite of grumpy. Well, you know what? What? Doesn't matter. Oh, God. <laughs> Could you be any more evasive? 
Why? What am I evading? I, I'm just, um, basic human connection, I guess. Says the man with mummy rock. I spit the bacon at you. <laughs> what was that? We're gonna wander over to the campfire. Was that bacon? <laughs> Trade. For what? Put your foot in your mouth here. I'll go put my foot in my mouth over there. <laughs> I'm sorry. Did we literally tag bacon? team awkward conversations. <laughs> Did you give her bacon? I'm cradling Bork. Yeah. And hushing him. I'm gonna, I'm gonna slyly take a slice of bacon and eat it where all of can't see. Yeah, I'm just, but be oh. happy about it. It's okay. Think before okay, you mock it out. Fair. <laughs> Fair. Um... Eggs next time, Rodrigo. I wish I could find fresh eggs in the desert that I was trustworthy, that were trustworthy. So, Neith, I know you're sort of the silent partner in this whole venture, but... Yeah. <clears throat> but I really don't believe in prying into your past any more than I've already tried to do. But if this is going to be difficult for you, we need to know so that we can help as best we can. So that some of us can try to help as best we can, and Chief can be kept distracted as best he can. Excuse me? Don't worry about Chief. I can deal with Chief. What about these... Our name is Ryan. What about these Aww. trenches? Go back over the campfire. I am over here. I'm shouting at you. God damn it. You don't need to tell me any more than I need to know, but if this is going to affect your abilities. If this is going to bother you, it's something we have to address. When I... we bring Hakatep's pyramid down, we're going to need to be ready to fight him. A better him than the ghost that... And I point at Chief's face, like I'm really concerned. <laughs> you, never, you never saw him the first time this happened. Pus. Do you want some water? This has happened before. <laughs> he wants. I thought it was incurable. Mm, no, no, we managed to fix it once. We'll fix it again, don't worry. He may, he may be older and... I can't wait to fix that mess. ...frailer than he was before, but you know, he'll, uh, he'll survive. As for these, uh, these trenches... <laughs> I can't say I'm excited about it, and I can't say I'm excited that it's Panya's people that made these trenches. But as of right now, I don't see any reason that it would affect me. So, it's not a boat. Oh, no, because you weren't there for that session, but Neith was in the room. Um, Panya's uh, family was forced by Hakatep to build them. Right. So they didn't, like, were like, oh, yeah, these slaves look good, let's get them. <laughs> they too were kind of controlled by Hackatep. Mm. Just for reference. And kept sport. No, and kept's done tallying. Yeah. And kept's just got like piles of, <laughs> of gold. He's like, well, I'm an accountant as well as a burialist. <laughs> Would it help to talk about the boat? <laughs> no. I don't know that it was the boat that was the problem. I, I more meant, yes, your time on it. I, I didn't. <clears throat> oh, yeah, here's just a sec, Chief. What's up? Sweet. Looks I, uh, good. Mm. You guys also met this guy, but you don't get his card until you meet him in person. Oh. We met oh, him? Oh, that's Hackett's hat. In person. Well, that's not good. Can we see him again? What a fucker. What a looks raver. Like the lead of a metal band. <laughs> a really old metal band. I mean. <clears throat> oh, so, yeah. Yeah. Is it something, would it help for you to talk about it? I don't, I can't say that much happened. And I wouldn't be who I am without that experience. I'm torn. Take your time, then. We have uh, several watches and uh, four more creatures to kill. Yeah. <laughs> true. It's true. 
I'm gonna take another slice of bacon away from all those eyes and lunch on the bacon. Where Pork did squeals. you get this? This is the, this is the last of the fresh food I bought oh. from the market yesterday. Where's that board game? It's Panios. I uh, I sailed with uh, some <laughs> former slaves. Uh, some of them talked, some of them didn't. I can't say that one was better than the other, but they were all uh, good men and women, so just know that uh, whatever you need, you have my support. Can I? I appreciate it. So, you really should consider coming to live in the Riverlands. There is no slavery there. I don't know what you're asking me. The weirder the, the show. Riverlands! <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of people like him, though. See? Okay. You had me sold for so long. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm eavesdropping. Oh. His eavesdropping was zero charisma. <laughs> I figured. I figured. Yeah, only the witch talks. Oh god, I never considered it. He's from a long time ago. What if they're I like appreciate conversation. his descendants? Even if it's... Oh god. What if... Black <clears throat> no. What? None of what? my family acts like him. <laughs> no, we're entirely separate. You think... You think... Sheep has children? Mm-mm. No, nope. not even going there. Everything's great. Yeah, if you ever want to talk, please let me know. <laughs> Alright, you guys gonna go to bed? Nap time. Nap time. Alright, I need two things. Oh no. First off, everybody but Rodrigo make me a will save. <sighs> Come to Hack Attack, baby. Sound? 15? Yeah. Fuck! 19. We really should have checked to see if Hack Step was actually in me. He gave me the look. He got the... How could we Thank detect you. those? I don't know, detect magic? <laughs> I mean, not don't magic. have detect magic. Detect evil? Detect evil? Snap you and see if you believe oh, me. Okay. I think I have detect evil. 24. His face. <laughs> so you got 15? 12. 12? 15. Okay. So, Neath, you're woken up in the middle of the night by an uncomfortable feeling as if someone is watching you. You turn over, um, and the fire is starting to go out. Um, Lady Sophronia is walking around the room, kind of just punting about. But you notice coming from the mud room, there are two red eyes watching you, low to the ground as if the head was just sticking out of a hole, a, a hole in the floor. <laughs> there is a low chuckle. It's womanly but kind of distorted and then it just sinks underground and you see a heavy stone slab slide over and you saw her holy fuck you've been just put that close to the camera thinks you know there are times when revealing the monster isn't scarier and there are times when it is Sick. Roderick, you're able to get back to sleep, but you do not sleep well tonight. You're, you're like, you actually rest, so you're not fatigued, but... Rodrigo, in the middle of the night, you are woken. And you hear a voice coming from outside of the room. Rodrigo. I stand up, draw my rapier, but keep it loose and walk over to the edge of the doorway. I knew this was coming. As you walk close to the doorway, you see a large creature, as you know, as Ninru said, walk into the mud room. Yes. Come. Let's talk. I follow. So you're standing in the mud room? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> You've done as I've asked. You've killed the Forgotten Pharaoh. I promised you anything. This Sphinx is now fully ours. Arishkakal's power is fully attuned to start spreading in the cosmos again. And for that, I thank you. Now I know you were probably quite aware that we Glabrezu's distort. But you have met me with an even hand, and for that I wish to reward you. Anything, Rodrigo, it is yours. Uh. 
DM, I'm going to need a moment. Sure. To come back to that. Sure. <clears throat> um, he will agree to meet you tomorrow night, then, in his chamber. He offers you safe passage. Uh, a Rishkabed, a Rishka um, Sargoda, and uh, Heket will not trouble you. We are all that remains here. <laughs> or even if we wanted to roll to the morning and have whatever Rodrigo says be back dated later. That sure. would also be cool. Sure. Sure. Yeah, that'll work. As long as it doesn't have an immediate effect like, I want to talk, I want to have a little frog tongue. <laughs> <laughs> I'll make it I'll, I'll try and make it subtle or sure. say that like whatever my wish is I want to be able to call on it in the moment sure I'd like a frog tug when I say I want a frog tongue um, he actually can't do a wish like that okay um, so we'll spend some time and talk tomorrow yes that's what he'll say okay yeah he, he then offers you back to bed and he says paladin in there we keep her here for amusement and then he begins to walk away. She was still awake. Wasn't she didn't. She, she didn't. He, she didn't really. Okay. You have to see if she noticed. Perception check. <clears throat> Twenty-six. For your stealth. No. To oh. see if she noticed. Uh, she sees you walk back into the room. Yeah. I'm just gonna look at her. Yeah. Go back to bed. <laughs> yep. It's the morning! You're all fully rested. Chief has one charisma. <laughs> <laughs> so, what you needed to do um, is, you know how like I tell you every time you rest, you can spend time with Bork to reattune your spells? Mm. You're going to want to add the other bl uh, purple spell that is remove disease. Oh, it's over in the other room. Yeah, so we'll just basically just remove one of your purple spells temporarily. Like, okay, probably sure. this... this does this twilight knife just overnight is yeah, fine? Yeah, sure, yeah. And then give me two purple cubes. So just give me actually one more. And Chief's mummy rod is gone. Your stats go back to normal. Okay. Can I get all these back? Yep. Why, do you, why does that cost two? Because it's two purple spells. You have to cast them one after another. Oh, to right. Remove okay. mummy rod. Got it. Because mummy, mummy rod is both a disease and a curse. Yes. All right, it is morning. You guys feel good? Chief is old and pretty again. Not that Pretty old. ish. So, how do you feel? Much better, thank you. No problem. What a good night. I feel well rested. Probably because we had a rigorous combat. It's always good to get a good sleep after that. Penny and I had a great conversation. It was very one sided. <laughs> <laughs> That's why it was good. She didn't yell at me. You can yell me. She's going, Arr. No, she didn't even make the buzz. No buzz. No buzz. <laughs> Not sure how I Sick. feel about that. Sick, Rodrigo. Sick. Sick! I'm, I'm just looking at the wish spell. I know. Yeah. I know. Uh-oh. <laughs> so... <laughs> What do we kill first? Uh, well, the mud room's right there. You want to serve with the Sphinx? You want to serve with maybe something littler? She was here last night. Interesting. Like in the room? Right. <laughs> uh, would you care to elaborate? It's hard. She was out there. In the mud room. She watched us last night. In the, from the mud room? Yes. There you go. That's, we well, knew she was there. She wasn't Is that alone. not weird to you? She wasn't alone? How did she get out? Mean, she wasn't alone. You mean she's locked in with time? I don't care for a minute! What? What happened? What? Shut up! I didn't see her. But... I received some very sincere thanks. For From our this guy. service. Killing the Forgotten Pharaoh. He wants to offer me a gift. I ask him for a night to think about it. They're laughing at you, I say to the paladin. They know you're here. All of them. They're working together. They don't care. They've kept you here all these years just to watch your defiance. 
they've known this whole time. They've never been sealed away. You see someone have a quiet emotional breakdown, and she sits down against the wall. Good. She and I mirror each other. Um. Is that a road you want to go down? What's the bigger problem? I'm asking myself. Hakatep? Or this cult? My knowledge of spells. I mean, your gift could be like, get out of this universe. Can you do that? Uh, I don't, would that even affect a creature like him? I don't, I don't know anything about him or no. what he can do. But he promised it would be a straight favor, too. He seemed to think that I uh, knew more about him than I did. He told me that normally uh, he likes to twist these things, but he feels I uh, earned a fair deal. Um... Didn't you want the mask? Why just you? Because Rodrigo's quick to bend the knee. Snap. <laughs> um, there possibly might be other reasons. No, by all means. Chief uh, is of course right. It's because, frankly, I'm only considering how best uh, to uh, earn my uh, dark reward. Uh, what would give me the most pleasure in life? I wonder, Chief, do you have any thoughts? What, what does a man most desire? You know me so well, after all. Money? Seems to be your main motivator. Hmm. Hmm. I thought... I'm going to once again imperceptibly step towards Rodrigo. <laughs> I... made a pretty big mistake when I first came here. And I had a man tell me he looked into me and saw something better. And I thought I saw the same in you. But then you just... are so quick to, you know, bow to a demon. Shakes my faith in you a little. Now I've been trying ever since the night gave him the benefit of the doubt to do good by him. But it seems Every step we take, the further along we go, the more and more you seem to shut in, be in it for the gold, and maybe I was wrong. I just don't want to be. Now what would you have us do? Not kill it? No, I want to kill it. Yeah. I am determined to kill it. I'm not talking about it. What? I, I am talking about the Forgotten Pharaoh. This all came about because we killed her, did it not? No. No, this is separate. This is... This is a completely different quest line. This is, um... <laughs> Rodrigo... They just happen to be in the same place. Being... He told us a demon offered him a deal, a city, gold, wealth beyond measure. And he didn't have the time to take it. Now when we confront the demon face to face, not just Rodrigo, but a lot of you, the quicker than I would like to just say, yeah, just agree to help him. 
just agreed not to die that day. <laughs> he wasn't going to do anything. No, the, you didn't know that. We didn't know that. It was a very big unknown. At least if we gave him the option to not that day in exchange for possibly something, you we could walk out of that room. You think that a demon walked away by some sort of magical lightning door who's asking us to do his bidding is going to just... If we say no to him, he's going to just up and kill us? No, he'll find a way to do it himself. But then why, why would he allow us to continue walking around the dungeon? Because he wants to toy with us. He wants to distort us. He's evil. He wants to influence us, and he wants to fracture us. And by God damn, did he do a good job. Yeah. We're stronger together. I don't disagree. But I can't look into the hearts of man like a demon can, apparently, and offer him... Whatever his deepest desire is. Give him his one wish. No, I suppose you already have yours, don't you? I thought we were over this conversation. I thought so, too. I thought we had, last session, or last, yesterday, we had come to a conclusion that we were right in what we did. I what is to... mine, Rodrigo? Your what? What is my wish? This. This whole thing. The world coming to an end and you right front center stage with it. Romance, adventure, action. I know your type. Gold doesn't motivate you, no? No, something else does. Glory, fame, all those things that get any other man killed. And you just wander through it. The hero. Well, fine. You have your wish. And no man can take it from you because you live it already. Some of us have to think more about things like that. <sighs> what is our plan for today? Or would anyone else like to weigh in on my uh, decision? We what are you going to do, buddy? <coughs> and with that, we're going to call an end to tonight's stream. Of note, you guys are, I assume, go shopping, get all your items, but there's going to be an encounter when you do go shopping, so we're going to have to run that. Just the shopping session next time. <coughs> so we'll still we get, get a, We can get, yeah, go load our buy items. everything, assume you're going to buy it, but there's going to be an encounter while shopping. Okay. Yeah. Please tell me something a minute for all. Actually, do me a solid. Um, <coughs> write down the list of everything you guys want. Mm -hmm. And then depending on how you go with the, uh, the interaction, will determine how much you can buy in your 10 minutes. Yeah, We're going to we'll get talk, a we'll talk about this list after. Uh, after <coughs> yeah, so that's what we'll do is um, just uh, do that and uh, there'll be something that comes up. All right, so you guys have, uh, let's stop the recording.